hi right, what's up guys welcome back to the channel and welcome back to today's video so in this video we're going to learn how to fix zoom network error unable to connect to your service you are getting on your pc this is going to be an easy tutorial so let's get started this error most likely occurs due to your internet connection or due to zoom servers down so the first step to solving this problem is to close the zoom application on your pc and scroll down to your system tree and exit the zoom application the next step is to go to your browser and search for uptime.zoom.us to check the availability of the zoom servers and uh, past occurrence so when you're done this the next step is to check your internet speed to go to this web website speedtest.net and check the speed of your internet if it's good enough so if this network error still persists the next step is to change your dns address so to do this we are going to open our control panel and make sure to view by category click on network and internet can navigate to network and sharing data then click on your internet connection then open properties after opening properties click on internet protocol version 4 so this is going to open a window to help you change your DNS server address so click on use the following dns server so for your preferred dns server i'm going to use 8 8 8 8 8 and for the alternate dns server we're going to use 8 8 Four, four. These are the Google official DNS server address, which are safe and secure to use. This also fix error on any application on your PC. To further fix this network error, make sure that your device network adapter are up to date. So to do this, open your Windows and search for device manager when device manager is opened up double click on your device network adapter and open right click on the particular network adapter you're using click on update driver and select search automatically for drivers this should take a few seconds to make sure that your network adapters are up to date so we have come to the end of this tutorial video if you have any question or suggestion please write in the comment section and if you found this video helpful please hit the like button and also subscribe to our youtube channel